Yo, what's the word? King Lux 74 coming at you. Thoughts from a boss, man. I had to come across something from you because, I mean, as you can already tell without even me saying that, I'm cut from a different cloth than most of you dudes. Pure alpha from the birth. So let me get into something about these females because, I, you know, I, I'm giving people a lot of life topics, politics, economics, but it seems like what y'all really want to know is about these females, man. So let me explain something to you and, and, and how to, how to, how to, you know, I, 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 I'm, I'm not going to say that I study people, but I do listen to other fellas like myself. And it's just, you know, more of a confirmation thing than an actual learning. You understand what I'm saying? So basically what, what, what I like to do you know, uh, Alpha Male Strategies, he's a top, one of, my, one of my top guys that I like to listen to. And what he talks about is basically becoming a high value male. You know what I'm saying? Now that is, is no doubt, no doubt. Being a high value male is the number one way to attract these women. I promise you, that's the number one way to attract these women. Because basically, like really, when you're a high value male, you really just, you really just don't have time. You know what I'm saying? As much as I want to fuck with her, you know what I'm saying? I like fucking with my money way better than I like fucking with these bitches. Because like my grandfather always told me, man, you, 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 you never going to lose a bitch chasing some money, but you're going to always lose your money chasing a bitch. You know what I'm saying? Whether you want to pay for some pussy or take her on a date, whatever you want to do, it's going to cost you some money, man. So some people like to get to the point quicker. Some people like to drag it out. I'm a, I, I, me... You know, I'm a whatever kind of guy, I go with the flow. So, I had this dude telling me, man, how you know if a girl really digging you? How do you know if, 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 if she gonna flake on you or not? You know, how do I know, you know what I'm saying, uh, I'm gonna make a date with her and, and, and boom, you know what I'm saying, I'm gonna clean my Friday out and I'm gonna get with her, you know what I'm saying, and then but Friday come, the bitch disappeared. She can't pick up the phone. She ain't calling you back. You ain't got no rhyme or reason. Some of these dudes ain't even heard from her ever again. Some of them, you know, she called back a couple days later. You know, as it, many, as many, as many of motherfucking reasons why that happened. You know what I'm saying? I, it'll all come out in the end. You know what I'm saying? What's in the dark always come to the light. But I'm going to give in a case an example. You know what I'm saying? Of... of what it takes you know okay so boom i met the chick i probably we may have gone out one time but i've talked to her for like four years you understand what i'm saying and while we went out the first time one of her friends was like man you, you need to take her home you know what i'm saying because she she probably need that that's what one of her friends said no bullshit you know what i'm saying but I don't know, when we went out, kind of wasn't feeling it all the way, you know what I'm saying? And then I had to get back because I had something to do in the morning as well. But, you know, whatever's whatever. I passed up on it. And then, you know, a couple times it seemed like I flaked on her, you know. But now we rotate back around and we pick up again, you know what I'm saying? I'm a busy dude. I ain't tripping off this shit. I probably ain't spoke to her in about a year. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't tripping off that. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm, I'm still tall. I got others in rotation. I meet bitches. I see bitches every day. So all it is, is a hi, how you doing? A, you know what I'm saying? A natural organic conversation turns into a phone number exchange and so on and so forth. You know what I'm saying? I go to work. I meet bitches. You know what I'm saying? You go to the gym. They everywhere, man. This is a planet. You know what I'm saying? So basically, how I know that she's interested. Okay, so... First, you know, uh, I just told you, we I've talked to her for at least four, maybe even five years. I don't even know, off and on, you know what I'm saying? A text here, text there. We might not talk for three, four months. This last time, we haven't talked for a whole year. So, I forgot how we got back into contact this last time. I think she's trying to sell me on a flight program. But uh, the last time I remember speaking... Uh, she was going she was calling me her travel buddy like we're gonna travel places together you know understand what i'm saying so this time when she hit me back she was selling me a flight uh program or some shit so that right there lets me know she's interested because i connect dots right there boom a flight program you i'm your travel buddy so i can get cheaper travels we can travel together all right so so i talk we talk a couple exchanges on the text so i know she's being funny but she's like okay so 
you know, sometime before the year is over with, we should get together, have dinner or something. You know what I'm saying? Before the year is over with, it's like fucking May. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? So, boom. All right, so, you know, we sporadically talk and talk, you know, so I text her on her birthday, happy birthday. I know it's a couple days off. That wasn't on purpose, but that tip shit like that works. You know what I'm saying? Not doing it on the birthday, but still remembering it. So, you know, saying shit like that works. But, um, so I was a couple days off, but it works. So, you know, then I hit her back like, yeah, when was you trying to go have that dinner? You know what I'm saying? So she tells me she's very free in the next week. You know what I'm saying? Uh, her daughter is out of town. So right there, that lets you know she's very high interest right now. Right now, she's very high interest in me. When a woman tells you I am very free next week, what that basically means, you know, so I text her back and I say uh, something to the effect that, well, you know, which it ain't, it ain't even no lie though, it's the truth. You know what I'm saying? Something to the effect that like, you know, uh, shit happened at work where motherfuckers is basically we ain't really got to be here and we really don't have to be here right now you know what i'm saying we in here basically uh something happened motherfuckers fucked up so we had to hire an outside company to come in and do the cleanup it's gonna take the outside company two weeks to do the cleanup in that meantime they really don't even want us in the building you know what i'm saying so we basically here holding the outside company's tool set <laughs> <laughs> getting paid top dollar to be on the internet doing some more thoughts of a boss you know what i'm saying so i ain't telling no lies you know what i'm saying and that's part of the thing that that attracts the women to me is they know i ain't telling no lies so when it come down to it yeah you know next week could work out you know what i'm saying let me let me uh see what's going on at work and then i'll let you know now when you tell me that you're very available next week you know what I'm saying? What that lets me know is that there's a high interest. So if Wednesday night I'm free, I'll call her and she she's probably going to drop whatever she wants to do to get with me. You see what I'm saying? Now, from there, it all goes to what you want to do with that, fellas, because you see you got the upper hand. So, you know, I'm not going to lie. The best, the best bet right now for you know given the circumstances and what it is if you're trying to build a rotation if you're a player like me with a two capital p's that i am in between then it's some things that you're gonna do you know you're gonna have to dick her down you know what i'm saying when i mean dick her down i mean you're gonna have to dick her down you know what i'm saying maybe y'all don't know how that's another thing i'm i'm not the one that's gonna teach you how to dick a bitch down you know what i'm saying you're gonna have to get you a bitch to teach you how don't feel bad because the bitch taught me how you know what I'm saying? That's no, most of my game came from these bitches. I'm going to keep it 100 with you. Most of my game came from these bitches. You know what I'm saying? A lot of it came from my grandfather. And a tiny fraction of confirmation game came from these niggas on the internet and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? But, but word bond, man. That's what I'm finna do for y'all, man. I'm finna give y'all the game for these hoes. Because y'all don't care nothing about no politics. Y'all don't really care nothing about getting you no money. But I'm going to tell you. You better get you some money if you want to fuck with these hoes, man. King Lux 7-4, I'm out, man. Control yourself. <laughs>